Whether you're driving a motorcycle or a car, chances are you've gotten stuck behind some road construction already this summer. Drivers are noticing a lot of more orange cones and road close signs across the city of Sioux Falls. Here's a list of the current construction projects in Sioux Falls. Minnesota Avenue and Russell Street intersection. 8th Street Bridge reconstruction. Citywide water main. Hold Avenue from 28th Street to 33rd Street. Phillips Avenue from 14th Street to 18th Street. Well, you get the picture. Contractors doing projects for the city of Sioux Falls will put up a lot of orange signs and orange cones as the city oversees around 100 projects this year. About half the projects involve the surface of the street, fixing potholes, resurfacing the street. The other half involves underground projects, like installing this storm sewer culvert. Principal City Engineer Brad Ludens says the city does a lot of legwork to minimize the impact on traffic. They will tweak the timing of traffic lights and study the best detours, all to keep traffic moving. The 33rd Minnesota behind us here is a great example of uh, you know, the main driver behind that project was the street condition, the street surfacing was in poor shape. But we don't just go in and just, okay, let's do a street surfacing project. We take a look at, okay, well, what else needs to happen here? Does, you know, are the underground utilities in good shape? Does, do we need to replace the water main? Do we need to upsize the storm sewer? Terry McKenzie of Harrisburg was running errands with his wife when we caught up with him. He says he had to do some creative driving because of the orange signs. Well, it took us a while to even get to this parking lot because we came just across, come up one road, everything's blocked, you gotta go around different, it's crazy. Is it frustrating? Uh, it is at times. Ludens says he understands that frustration. Well, I've had construction in my neighborhood on my commutes to, to work too, so I, you know, I understand where, where the frustration lies and you know, it's, it's just part of, uh, part of summer here in South Dakota and we do our best to work through it. For people driving in and around Sioux Falls, it's not just city projects. The state is also diverting uh, traffic on several interstate projects.